Let me create some green dye. Hi everyone, my name is Lucas. I'm the product evangelist here at Game Show, and today I'm showing you the brand new Twitch Alerts integration built into Game Show 3.0. It's super simple to set up. I'm going to show you real quick. First thing I'm going to do is choose the scene where I want to put Twitch Alerts. I'm going to put it right here in my chat and alerts box, and I'm going to click the plus sign to add a new source. Drop down to my Twitch widgets and choose Twitch Alerts. It's going to open up a brand new window here, and the first thing I need to do is authenticate my Twitch account with Twitch Alerts by clicking the Authenticate button. I'm going to approve that. Then I want to go in and configure my Twitch Alerts, and you'll see it opens up the basic Twitch Alerts website. You're familiar with it. You've seen it before, and I don't need to do anything. I just got to make sure that my settings are saved. Choose that, and then close this window. Now in this box, I can choose what will show up within my stream. I can choose from the alert box all the way down to my event list or maybe my chat box. Today I'm just going to show you the alert box and I'm going to have my follows and my subscriptions and all these things. I can change my width and my height if I'd like, but I'm going to leave it as is for now. And you'll see it pops up right here in my preview window outlined with a yellow box. Now if I go to Twitch alerts and I test my follower alert, that should pop right up there, or maybe my subscription alert, which will pop up as well. So it's that easy. It's built into Game Show, and all you have to do is just authenticate with Twitch Alerts, and you're good to go. So enjoy Game Show 3.0, enjoy the new Twitch Alerts integration, and we'll see you out there.